Welcome to the Dollhouse Dolls and very happy Pride to all of you, especially those that don't celebrate. A very special shout out to all my Barbies who I used to make. Scissor! There was a meme that said, happy Pride to all my Barbies who I made kiss. So, not full license on the creativeness of that. Okay, so to kick off my pride unboxings in the Ganja Claus doll house. I am starting with my second ever new Monster High, and it is Claudine Wolf. And I haven't gotten too deep into this franchise, though I've been a huge fan for a long time. Um, however, I have gleaned from various YouTubers and doll collectors dual collectors that, well, and I guess Monster High fans, that uh, they feel like Claudina, Claudine was gay. And, uh, and there was, I feel like, some chatter about the designers um, kind of wanting that direction. And big surprise, who didn't? I mean, also, talk about, like, what the fuck in the doll world and like why can't we have representation rainbow high and you have no gay characters <sighs> i don't know why it took me so long and my pal alexa was like wait because the rainbow high released their new like white doll that you get to customize that feels like a doodle bear from the 90s except for less cool and it's like flopsy the like holiday um these all these doors are supposed to come on but i got this off of i believe amazon or i mean something and obviously they all came off because if you order them online you're gonna get them a little fucked up okay finish my thought Let's see if I can catch the thread. Uh, okay, so yeah. How are you calling yourself Rainbow High with no gay characters? Though I have to imagine a huge piece of your fan... Well, I guess not because adult collectors maybe aren't a huge piece of the fan base. But anyway, we were the loudest probably. And we have the most expendable, like, you know, dual cash, right? <sighs> whatever it's disappointing and so here let's enter into the canonical true canonical record the ganja claws dual house Claudine is gay gay honey gay 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 she gay let's see how gay when we open this puppy up okay oh uh She's so cool. Wow. Beautiful face up. The cat eyes are gorgeous. She's got freckles. She's got a great little nose. Her hair looks cool. It's crimped. Magenta and light pink. She's got on like rainbow leopard bike shorts. Yes, please. These shoes, yes please. This top, yes please. Okay. Let's pop this. Okay. <laughs> She's gonna like literally try and take her right out of here. She in there. This door's not, but and that drum's not. Everything else is okay. Some kind of instructions. There's a key in here. That uh you like unlock, you put in water or something and uh, each like different key color is supposed to unlock the different door. But hot hack, if you're not into water play with your dolls, seems like the color comes right on the key bottom. So not that we needed this to open them, but we do need it to close them, it turns out. Okay, I should get her out of the box first, right? 
And did I say that this key works for all the boxes? Oh, okay. Oh, here, we'll just lock it for ourselves. So then the true surprise can happen. Get you back on. We're here for the full effect. Okay, they are all locked. And Claudina, my suite is almost free. Are you kidding me? Somehow they still managed to give us the plastic pegs in the head. Oh my God. Oh my God. Why do they do this to us? Okay. Produced a girlfriend. Came and saved my ass. It took two of us to get this bitch out. She's out though. Her hair is garbage. Hot garbage. It looks real cute. It's hot fucking garbage. I just like, just from running my fingers through it, I had like a huge clump of hair that just like came out. And it's like, I don't know. I guess gel, hopefully. Um, I did read something today about how like the quality of the hair is pretty, leaves a lot to be desired. Okay. 2021 Mattel. We've got Velcros in the back. We've got the open back on the shoes. We have got a fully Articky baby, except for her Ankies, which is fine. We take what we can get around here, as long as we've got that wristy, that elbow, those knees, that hip, that head. Oh, yeah. We live in. All right. Let's uh, hang out with our girl, Claudine. She is really beautiful. Did y'all get a close-up on that face? See, even you can, I mean, this is, that's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. For like a, I think she was like $29 or something, the Sculptmits. 30 bones, probably all said and done. Mm -hmm. Okay, put the key in the way of the right hole. Okay. Our first surprise. Ooh, it's squishy and hard. We get another key, which um, I think they make a fun accessory if you do do them in water, because uh, they'll all change colors, and then there's like a keychain. I have watched some unboxings of these and reviews. Okay, we've got a very cute purple vinyl jacket with a little faux fur collie. We have another t-shirt that matches her shorts with this very cute rainbow band that says howl how bitch and this very cute zebra print fuchsia blue and perpy little jean skirt number velcro in the back a little button detail these are some great accessories i really like that a lot okay i'm just gonna use that Does this really not? Okay. Just, I don't know why. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm high. Big duh. Oh, we have a key that was not dyed black. <laughs> Got our green key pre-soaked for us. I love that. I'm saving this packaging. Okay, we've got some little moon earrings in gold. Should probably just get those in her cute little ears. I do love, I love, I love an anthropomorphic doll. I don't know if you know that, but I do. And this is no exception. She's beautiful. She's gay. She belongs in my collection. See what I did there? Okay. and. Yes. All the yeses to this fucking bucket hat leopard situation. Oh, I'm probably going to have to take off her earrings to get. Oh, no. Nope. Just force it, you know? There's a will, there's a way. Oh, my frigging gauze. Wash your damn hair. <sighs> Hello. 
Hello, you're cute. She is so cute. <sighs> I'm very, I'm, yep, I'm in. I'm a, I mean, I always was into Claudina, Claudine, but ever more so, ever more so. Again, like Laguna, you know, he's my girls. Oh, we have a tiny tot coming on set. Tiny Tegan tot. Where's my doll, bitch? Okay, here's our key ring, which is very cute. Little monster high skull and bow. And we got our second pair of shoes. Oh, these are giving, yeah. Oh, I love that. They're moon boots, but like a little more fashionable because wolf moon. That's brilliant. Friggin' brilliant. Ding dong design is ding dong. That's a very, I'm in, I'm in. And like all the branding is like the moon phases, phases of the moon. She's like Remus Lupin, but cuter, right? Okay. Oh, and we've got one more. One more little lucky. Um, this whole setup can also be hung up on like the wall. So you can use it as like a wall display, which I think is, I, yeah, I love a multi, multi-pronged approach for my gauze. Okay. I think I got them all. Okay. We got a little plastic purple bottle that's translucent, like a wolf howling at the moon. We have a little moon and leopard candy bar. And we have a little bone sandwich with some little purple icing. All hard plastic, all very cute accessories. These are, we don't need hangers, we don't need combs. We need extra shoes, cute accessories that are functional. We need good hats, we need good earrings, good jewelry. Don't give us any more fucking combs or like lame accessories in lieu of outfits. Um, I'm looking at you, MGA. Rainbow high with no gay characters. How are you gonna have a high school, whole high school called Rainbow High and Shadow High? Hello, goth, goth queers, you know? And have no gay characters. All these girl dolls, no gay characters. You're dreaming, bitches. You're dreaming. All right. Holy crow. Claudine, welcome to the dollhouse doll. I can't wait to wash your goddamn hair and bring you to your most perfect glory. And best of all, ship the shit out of you. Thanks for dueling with me, dolls in the dual house. Hit that subscribe, like, comment. Tell me who your favorite Monster High character is and why you think they're gay. And also, how are you dolling and celebrating Pride this month? Drop it in the comments. Would love to hear from you.